In this series, we are going to be starting from absolutely nothing and trying to acquire all the riches that Los Santos has to offer. Welcome to Broke to Ballin'. Hello there, everybody. Welcome back to your favorite series on YouTube, Broke to Broke. And today we're going to be chasing that paper, N not money, unfortunately, uh, just paper. If you haven't guessed already, we're doing Operation Paper Trail or the ULP missions, as you can also call them. So uh, enjoy. I, I you can do what you want, man. I don't care. So if you guys did tune into the mission where I reached RP rank 100, I went through the career progress tracker and realized there are quite a few sets of missions I have not done yet. One of them being, uh, where are they? The Operation Paper Trail unit missions. Did I just say units? Operation Paper Trail missions. Of course, I also haven't done a super yacht life, but we need a yacht for that. I haven't done Gerald's last play, but... That's boring. But yes, I wanted to go ahead and do Operation Paper Trail because it is a fun set of missions and can be a little bit difficult. But just before we walk into that yellow circle of doom, the bike time trial is literally right around the corner. So I kind of want to go ahead and do that first because if you look at my bank account, yeah, we're a bit poor again. So uh, any money will help. And this week in GTA Online, the bike time trial is double money. I don't know if it still will be by the time this video is out, but for now it is. So $100,000 for about two minutes of work. I ain't going to say no to that unless it involves me getting down on my knees, of course. If you don't get that joke, uh, just wait a few years. Now, my last Broke to Ballin video was the one where we went ahead and checked out these new time trials. And since then, I've done quite a few of them on this account and on another account I have. And I'm going to be completely honest, this is one of my favorite additions to the game in a long time. I know it's not much money. I know it's not like a crazy business or a super cool heist, but I honestly love these. These time trials are really fun. They're quite easy and they're a really good daily source of money. 50k a day or 100k a day at the moment is fantastic for not wanting to put much effort in. And they're all pretty fun. So I, I got to give a big ups to Rockstar. This has been my favorite edition in quite a while. If you guys are enjoying it too, make sure to leave a like to show that, um, I don't know. Just do it, please. And honestly, if Rockstar could add in a plane time trial, a helicopter time trial and a boat time trial, um, I, I, I would gladly do stuff to them. In a, in a sexual way. And so there we go. A very easy time trial completed with 10 seconds to go. Sensational. And as you just saw there, $100,000 in the top of my screen, uh, which is very nice considering, again, I'm quite poor right now. Very, very poor, in fact. Like, this is getting concerning. I have so many businesses and ways to make money, but yet I'm still just down in the dumps. Oh well. Now we can go ahead and get started with the Operation Paper Trail. But just before we get started with that, once again, I did just upload a new video type on my channel called GTA Bingo that I did with fellow YouTuber Hacky. I think it's a really great video and maybe a few of you didn't see it because YouTube didn't recommend it or maybe you didn't click on it because it wasn't a broke to ball. And I highly recommend you go check it out. I think it's a really great video and I'm going to be continuing it on this channel. So make sure to go tune into that. It will be episode one pretty much and I hope you enjoy it. But apart from that, let's go ahead and get into the Operation paper trail. This should be, uh, very fun. First mission, ULP Intelligence. This is a federally classified brief. Well, I'm not allowed to tell you guys then, so let's get into it. That was just my way of uh, not having to read everything because I'm lazy and you probably don't care either way. Okay, we get some cool outfits here. What, what are we vibing with? Uh, I'm, I'm, oh, I'm not intelligent in real life, so we'll go with the agent. I do solemnly swear that I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States as interpreted by my immediate superiors in the IAA. That my duties may include interrogation, uh, phone tapping, suppressing reports, inventing reports, uh, paying bribes, taking bribes, the trafficking of drugs and arms, uh, the misappropriation of funds, and uh, lying to the American people whenever strategically necessary. It's honestly crazy how realistic this game is. Okay, my vehicle's over here, and yes, we're using the Paragon R that we got for completing the casino missions, I think? I just think this was the most FBI-like vehicle I have, and I don't really use it much, so might as well. Now, I have done these missions before. If you watch me back when I was doing my Adventures with Desmond series, I did these missions back then, and they were cool. I actually really enjoyed the uh, paper trail missions. I think the ending was really unique. They're quite fun with a little bit of difficulty, but not too ridiculous. Now it's a few months later. I've, I think, gotten better at the game and I kind of know what's going to be thrown at me. So I guess we'll see if that means I'm any better. You'll find to assume that I won't be because it, it's me. Come on, guys. Do you need to be so aggressive, man? Like, we're trying to infiltrate this silently, aren't we? Okay, find and hack Mason's computer. Now, unless it changes position, it should just be upstairs, I think. I don't know why I have to walk so goddamn slowly. There's no one in the house. Just let me, let me go. Oh my god. This is infuriating. Yeah, come on, get to the computer. You fat ass. Sorry. Here we go. Open my computer. External device. Brute force. And the... Don't know how I messed it up. And the same boring hacking... 
What is wrong with me? The same boring hacking thing that we do for every other mission in this game. Now there are two targets, one in the city and one in the, the poverty area, and we have to go take stuff. I don't remember the missions exactly, actually. I thought I remembered be them better than I do. I know you have to like find a generator, explode it, then go inside and like take some stuff. I think that's the general plot of this mission. Um, Don't quote me if I'm wrong, because I probably am. Let me go outside, dude. I don't care about your commentary. I'm not even listening myself. Uh, they make these really slow, don't they? Dude, let me- thank you. 2023 and you still can't skip cutscenes in this game. So we can go to the HQ or the depot. Uh, on my other time I went to the HQ first. Let's go to the depot first this time. Alright! This mission deals with the Duggan family. The same people we dealt with during the Diamond Casino missions. Why do they have to be such a massive pain in my ass? Like, I- I, I thought I got rid of you dudes already. I thought we came to a mutual agreement that you need to stop with me because I will destroy you. Like, wh what's going on? <laughs> oh, well we'll, well, we'll kill him soon. So we're here at the depot and we have to get a generator. Now, I remember last time I did this, I was looking around the building for a good 10 minutes before I realized it is right there. Yeah, I know. I'm not the brightest person. There's also two of them. Okay, I thought there was only one. Oh, uh, that's going to be more annoying then. Where would the other one be? Now, now my memory's failing me. Cool. I remember the easy one. Or I remember the difficult one, but don't remember the easy one. I guess it's time for a time lapse. There it is. That was not too bad. Okay, it's not letting me shoot it. Great. It was behind a pole. I didn't see that. There we go. Now we should step inside and it should turn pitch black, which is fine for me because I thrive in the night. AKA I, I don't sleep. I am an extreme insomniac. Uh, do we not? Oh, okay. I forgot we had a flashlight. That kind of jump scared me a little bit. All right, we're looking for an external hard drive and a VR headset. So either there's some pretty cool military technology or we're just going to be doing VR porn. Either way, I'm very excited. And there's a VR headset. Time for the porn. Let's go. Okay, I need to stop myself. Now a hard drive. I, I can be the hard part if we watch the porn. I'm sorry. <laughs> Seriously, where's this hard drive? It should not be this difficult to find. Oh, it literally says it there. I'm an idiot. Wait, does it? Where- I might just be blind, honestly. I did not see a hard drive there whatsoever. I only saw the thing on the mini- on the mini- 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 I'm gonna stop talking. Off to the FIB headquarters? Yep, that's what it is. AKA the most corrupt place in America. I'm joking, that's actually Disney. I'm joking, that's actually Fox News. I'm joking, that's actually the White House. I'm joking, that's actually your mother's basement where you live, you filthy rat. I'm joking, I'm sure you're a fine person. You watch me, at least. Uh, that's that's something right so we have to go get maintenance outfits yay well i don't think we have to we could go in aggressive and get all the heat on us but i'm i'm not feeling that today i want to go with the silent and sneaky route it's more entertaining it's more fun it's actually neither of those things it's it's less entertaining for you guys and less fun but um i can't be bothered so change out in public like the exhibitionist you are come on you slot sorry bro this guy is slow as hell Never mind, he's quick as hell. How did he change that fast? What? Okay. Now, I remember that once this mission is finished, you get shot at a lot. So I probably want to park my car somewhere that it can be used as a good getaway vehicle. And I'm going to just put it literally just here. Are you f***ing kidding me? Uh, whatever, man. Well, getting the disguises was a mistake. <laughs> I think, I think they saw that my car had weapons and they got angry at me. Oh, uh, whatever, man. This is more entertaining, I guess. I love how casually he goes from killing people and holding a giant minigun to just getting the elevator like a casual civilian. It doesn't make much sense. Did he say One Piece? The One Piece is real? No, I don't want to browse the internet. Pick up the item. What the hell? Oh, it's on the edge. Never mind. There we go. That's one, and hopefully the second one doesn't take too long, because I don't want to be here any longer than I have to. I will catch a, dis a, dis a disease from these FBI, FBI scum, FIB scum. You, you can tell I can speak the English tongue with absolute proficiency, can't you? No? Well, f*** you then. Uh, there it is. It's in the box. That's why I couldn't find it last time. It's always here, I think. I think this is the spawn spot, but because it's in this stupid box, you can't really see it unless you get close. So last time we did this mission, I spent like 20 minutes circling around this building over and over again, losing my mind like I do in every other video, and it wasn't very fun. I don't know why I'm telling you this. You don't care. You don't have sympathy for me. You enjoy my pain, and it's time for more pain. Are they using my car as cover? You bastards. You're not allowed to do that. It's my vehicle. You don't have permission. Well, I tried to eat snacks, but it just didn't let me. That's a really cool game. Thank you. I might need to eat them now, though. Uh, snacks. I only have smokes. Great. That's... I don't need a smoker right now, lads. I, I kind of need to drive away. It is... Uh, 
Oh, I'm so pathetic at this game. Help me, God. We're good. Don't worry. That was all, all according to plan. I definitely didn't mean to alert the guards at the start, then drive terribly after that, and then get injured a lot, and then basically lose all faith that my agency has in me. No, it all went to plan. Don't worry. Shit. That was nearly such a cool little, like, uh, sequence of driving, and then, I, and then I screwed it right at the end. It's like fumbling a date with a girl. I wouldn't know how that goes in the first place, but I imagine that's what it's like. Uh, losing the cops again? How many times have I done this now? A few hundred? Ah, uh, don't see me, don't see me, don't see me, don't see me, thank you. Goodbye. Yeah, this guy keeps trying to talk to me. I, I'm, I'm, I'm not listening to you, my guy. I'm sorry. I know you want to be respected because you're a big man with a big job in the IAA or whatever the hell. I don't care. Just let me do my job, please. Speaking of doing my job, but we're nearly finished with the first mission. Yatta! We did it! And we didn't die yet! This is a miracle! We're definitely gonna die later though, stay tuned. Ah, oh, we gotta finish the mission? Thank you. I don't know why there's always such a weird delay after you finish a mission. Like, just give me the end screen. I don't need the, like, awkward pause of silence. Like, I have enough of those in conversation in real life. You don't need to make me feel that way, game. It's really mean. Again, with the awkward pauses, I I'm not in need of that, guys. Oh, wow, a new career progress achievement. Let's go. I I'm sure we're going to be getting a lot of those since, again, it's I've been playing on this account for how long now? Nine months or something? And I've barely done anything in the game. So, yeah, expect those to keep rolling in. Uh, speaking of rolling, let's roll back up to Agent ULP. Haha, <laughs> that didn't make much sense at all. I'm sorry for the bad pun. It wasn't even a pun. I was, I was just, I'm a disappointment. Can you f***ing move? And you know what? With the limited money I have, let's go and waste some more. Now, I don't think I've upgraded this vehicle already. Pretty sure I haven't. Oh, no, I have some armor on it. Let's uh get some more, because why not? Brakes. Screw it. Let's just waste all my money on upgrading a new vehicle that I will use today and never again, because uh, transmission, 40k. Turbo, 50k. Uh, I can't be bothered doing that. Oh, we have some cool liveries here. I kind of like the green. That's so fucking clean. Oh, I'm going to do it. I know it's not as low key as you probably should have for like a FI or IAA vehicle, like a down low. Like, you know what I mean? But look at it. It's beautiful. And because it's beautiful, I'm also going to go ahead and get a nice little green trim on the inside. Bright green, lime green, lime green. Oh, hoo -hoo. oh I'm, I'm hard for that. Look at this. Now, this is a vehicle. No shit, Dan. Dude, look at my lean, mean green machine. Oh, mama. And Papa, I guess, if you want to say that. And, you know, while we're at it, I know we get new outfits within the missions anyways, but just so I feel aesthetic, let's, let's move on to this. I, I'm a fan of it. Now, Mr. ULP, I don't know what your actual name is, but uh, I'm here. Please use me. That, why did I say it? Counterintelligence. Agent, your next assignment is as follows. Okay, let's go. Readings for nerds, right? Guys, I'm sorry, I just never learned how. Okay, now because I didn't read, I don't remember what we're doing. Great, I'm sure it will come back to me. Where are we going? Where, where are we going? Just give me the location. Stop with this stalling. I don't care about your exposition, mate. You can go home and tell your wife that doesn't love you in the evenings. Just, just give me the destination. Come on, man. Cut. Oh my god, this is so long. Oh, it's the drones. Oh, I'm remembering the other missions in this set now. Some of them suck. Oh, I'm not looking forward to this. Oh, I regret everything. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, the missions for the Operation Paper Trail are coming back to me now. I'm starting to remember some of the ones in the in the lineup and ooh, they're not fun. They're they're a bit spicy in uh colloquial terms. But it's okay, because we have our lean, mean, green, queen machine. I couldn't think of any other words to rhyme. Alright, so I'm pretty sure how this works is we just have to stay inside a certain range of the drone and we hack it, which is obviously not that difficult. Uh, now Mr. Drone, where are you? You're flying over pretty much the water. Very helpful. Thanks, dude. Appreciate it. There we go. Easy. On to the next one. So guys, how's your day going? Did you win the girl? Get prom queen? I'm bad at small talk. Okay, drone, you're about to be mine. This is a really underwhelming mission. So far, I don't remember what comes after this, to be honest. Now, what, what do we do, big ULP intelligence man? Tell me and I will follow. I am your bitch. Ah, to a motel. Well, all great crack addicts live. Is there such thing as a great cocaine addict? I'm sure there is, I just don't know who. Actually, to be fair, it's probably just every lawyer, isn't it? Then again, then you have to ask, are lawyers great people? I have a friend that's one. I don't like it very much. I'm joking. Okay, to the crack den. Let's go. I'm sorry, fire hydrant. I, I didn't mean to abuse you like that. Um, why did we come in this way? Are we going on top? 
No, what? the GPS in this game is tragic at best. All right, here we go. Now, I'm pretty sure when I did this mission last time, the motel I went to was up in like sandy shores. So I will take this one as much closer and I'm still going to get knocked out cold with some gas or something. That's what I remember what happens. You get, you get knocked out cold, put in the back of a truck and have to escape. I believe that's what's about to happen. So, you know, a regular Wednesday for me, accessing laptop. All right, what shady files do you have on here, sir? Oh, that's, they're, they're definitely underage. Oh God. Why did you say perfect to that? Are you a pervert agent ULP man? I still don't know what your name is. Is ULP just your name? Uh, probably. Uh, there, there's the gas. Someone farted. Not me. Mine are um, silent, but lovely. Okay, maybe not. It wasn't me. I'm sorry. I lied. God, fart humor. You're 22, Dan. Jesus Christ. I love that even though I've been knocked out and I'm like tied up in the back of a van, I still know what vehicle I'm in based on the thing in the bottom right. The logic of this game is just stupendous. It also says the area I'm in, which I guess once you look out the windows, you can understand, but like, come on, man, really? All right, time to defuse a bomb. This should be pretty easy. I forgot what to do. Why is this so slow? Turn a bit faster, please, for the love of God. Oh, you can speed up rotation. I didn't realize you just hold down triangle. I'm just very really bad at following instructions, as you can probably tell by now. Sensational. Success. Yay. Now we, uh, try not to get killed by the vast amount of police that are surrounding us. We should be fine, I'm sure. Go, 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 go. Why am I in first person mode? Oh, well, let's just roll with it. Screw it. Yeah, I'm going to stick in first person. This makes it more realistic. Drive, boy, drive. I don't know why I'm telling myself that. Go! Off! Oh, Now we just try not to get killed, drive to the drop-off, and mission two complete. It sounds easier than it is, but I, I'm a god, so, you know, it shouldn't be a problem for me. And that's what you call an epic gamer move. Do you guys really have to be blocking the road? Like, seriously. Uh, why do there have to be trucks in my way? Please move, please move, thank you. Go! Okay, we're fine. So how are you guys enjoying the first person gameplay? Is it thrilling? Does it make you feel like you're in the moment? In the action? Or is it just kind of like, meh? It's it's fine if it is, I won't judge you. It is kind of meh, isn't it? Okay, let's go back. Da da da, da da da, da da da. Uh, slow down, stop, drop, roll. The police are on patrol. They have a helicopter, I'm screwed. Now let's go up here because for some reason the police just like, <laughs> what the, ch dude. What are you doing? Now, for some reason, this area is a really good place to go just to like get away from the cops. You can just kind of hide. Helicopters won't find you. Police uh, may find you. F please. I I'm a risk it. I'm a risk it for the biscuit and hope I get a brisket. If he finds me here, I will say I suck from the bottom of my heart. I suck. I suck. I suck. I suck. I knew it was gonna happen. I just I had to do it for the bit. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm apologizing to you I'm only causing myself more pain. Also that just proves never listen to me. I, I don't know anything about anything and with absolute ease and uh, Competency we have completed the second mission Well, not yet, but pretty much if I failed at this point you should unsubscribe But if I haven't failed and you're not subscribed then do it and a lovely stuff what the fuck just happened? Now we're finished. Good job, me. Good job. That was... That was really weird. I don't know what the hell happened there. All right, some more challenges not completed, but on the way to being completed. And I've spawned all the way out here, so time to drive all the way back to the city. Yes! I love driving. Okay, here we are back at Agent ELP for mission number three. Hey, that rhymed. Extraction time. That also rhymed. I'm so sick with it. Agent, your next assignment is as follows. So first we're going to Agent Johnson's garage and I believe this mission, if I remember, is where she's been kidnapped or is under attack or something along the lines and we have to go save her. So we have to go investigate her lost places, her garage and somewhere else. Then we go, we go save the damsel in distress, which is pretty much what this mission is. All right, here's the garage. Look around for some clues, shall we? Nothing there. There's some files here, which will be useful. Fantastic files, really enjoyed them. Some more files. This is thrilling stuff. If you aren't at the edge of your seats right now, then I don't know what you're doing. Can you fucking read, please? Now, there's a laptop here. We can open up, t turn it, turn it. Great, okay, cool, it's broken. I guess they uh, played too much League and smashed it to pieces. And we have a little armor, armory crate, crate thingy. Oh, that's a, that's a big square. What, that's a rectangle, what the fuck is wrong with me? You know, it's really difficult to make commentary on something that th that's this dull. I'm I'm sorry, I apologize. Okay, we have another crate here with also nothing in it. Epic, and now we take the car and go. I think that's the last thing we do here. I don't remember there being anything else. A final check, anything here? Here with the 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 filing cabinet. Nope. Let's get in the car. 
That was unnecessary, but okay. All right, now last time she was here for me. I don't know if she can be at every location. I don't know if it's like a specific location she's always at or what, but uh, let's go. Now, can we drive my car? Can we drive, do we have to be in this car? Okay, we can drive my car, perfect. Off to the beach. Or I'm gonna beach someone off. Agent Johnson, are you here? Doesn't seem like it. Next location. No beaching off today. I'm very disappointed by that fact, to be honest. Well, no Agent Johnson here either. And now that I'm remembering, she wasn't actually here. She was like around this area or something. She was like in the middle of a war zone. So I think what the mission might be is you check all three GPS locations and then it gives you another final location because Rockstar love doing that for some reason. I don't know, they have a bit of a weird fetish for it, but it is what it is. Their game, they can make the choices. Even if they're fucking wrong. Never mind, it is just a GPS location. Again, don't listen to what I say. I'm wrong about everything. You want to get in? Johnson? 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 Thank you. That took way too long for you to get in. You have a problem. I remember that mission being way more difficult last time. I thought you had to kill everyone. I didn't know you could just pick her up. So I was kind of just wasting time then. Nice one, big guy. You're really, you're really catching me there. Can we lose the cops already? They're kind of annoying me at this point. They just, they won't go away, man. Ah, oh, so now, now I can lose the cops. Cool, I couldn't do it back then when it was easier. Now I do it. Great, thanks game. appreciate it. They're still on me. They haven't seen me in like three minutes. I haven't had a single cop near me. Thank you, that took long enough. God, so the game just does it when it's convenient for them. It's, it's so stupid. Yes, this is extremely necessary. Don't worry about it. Uh, I feel a little faint. You feel faint. Really, I wonder why you would ever feel faint when I'm driving. You know, I, I, I do very normal things. I think you're quite safe in my vehicle, actually. Are you sure you're faint? Do you want to, like, sit in the back seat or something? Would that help? All right, I don't have a back seat. Well, you just strap in there. I'm, I'm sure you'll be fine, Agent Johnson. I'm sure nothing bad will happen to you. You'll get home perfectly safe. We don't need a hospital. You're, you're fine. Is this joke getting a bit old? Oh, what a nice mission this is. It's going really well, isn't it? Yeah, this is fun. this is bloody fantastic. I'm sure I'll get high praises from my fellow agent here. Probably get a promotion after this one. Oh, there's the other door gone. Who needed it anyways? Thank you. I know it was. I'm the best in the field, the best in the business, the best on the streets and the worst in the sheets. What a mission though. Johnson, hope you have a good day. Honestly surprised she can walk, but it's fine. Mission passed. It all went to plan. All, all went to plan. Okay, Agent UL, let me see you pee. What? Asset seizure. Agent, your next assignment is- All right, how long before you tell me what to do this time, Agent? How, how long? Why does this keep happening? GPS trace incoming. Is it incoming? Doesn't can seem like it, mate. Come on. Right. So this is the mission where you have to go to each individual radio, radar, whatever you want to call it, to uh, do the thing. Signal jammers. I'm really bad at explaining things. I'm sorry. You you know what we're doing. We're going to destroy signal jammers so we can get a better trace on where the van is. There we go. I finally learned how to speak. Now I don't see where this one is. I'm very confused. I'm trying to get in there without alerting or without having much combat, but I don't see where the jammer is. Hold on, let me go up the hill a little bit. I know this is entirely unnecessary, but I want to, so let me be. All right, give me the uh, RPG. I did get it recently, might as well use it. There. Right, this one. Now, last time I tried to destroy it without even getting on the roof. I'm gonna try again, because it's fun, but I don't know if it's gonna work. Grenade launcher, do your work. Oh my god, second try? Dude, I am elite. That was amazing. I really did not expect to be able to do that. <laughs> I don't know what that reaction was. I'm 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 pleased. All right, where's this next one hiding? Up there. I do see it. Now, can I railgun this from here? I do see the kind of top of it. Is this possible? It very much is. Very cool. Oh, I can see it. I can see it. Okay, maybe I can't get it though. Nope, I can, never mind. And then onto the part of the mission that is the most difficult from my memory, where you have to drive a shitty slow van from here all the way up to like sandy shores where you have helicopters and armed trucks coming at you. It's not very fun. I think I failed multiple times last time. So uh, let's hope for the best and expect the worst. I see you as well. Should be pretty easy. Goodbye. Now the van. I see it. Hello, mate. How you doing? Having a good day? How the f are you not dead? Bro, this guy's strong. All right, now, like I said, here is uh, the difficult part. 
Dude, you really just didn't have to do that. So we seal this van. That's fine. But as you can see, it's a slow ass garbage postal van and we have to drive it. Guess where? All the way up here. And, and no, driving's not the hard part. It's the enemies we deal with. Dude, look how slow it is. And the health is already down because I shot it a bit as well. Oh God, this is so bad. And there's the first enemy. And they all come in these trucks. So you can imagine how difficult this is. It's not even necessarily about me dying. It's the fact that possibly all the health of my van will be gone by the time I get over there and I won't be able to continue. And trying to shoot... Okay, that's fine. Trying to shoot while driving is not the easiest thing either, especially when you're this goddamn slow. And look, another enemy spawned. Oh, wow. That's cool. Thank you. Another one, please. Another, another kill, please. There we go. My accuracy has gotten a lot better, to be fair. I'm, I'm quite proud of myself in that respect. We also haven't taken a single hit yet. Like the truck has, but not me. The van, sorry. Oh my god, see, this is why this is so dumb. Oh my god, he just fucking shredded me. What was that? Could you stop mounting me, please? I'm not ready to be impregnated. Well, you just took care of yourself, thanks. See, we've only just gotten halfway there, and it's not going to get any easier. Do you know what? I'm actually very, very proud of myself. I'm hitting these shots like crazy. Put me up on phase clan because I am smoking these kids. Okay, get the snacks out. Get the snacks out. I don't have any snacks, do I? F I have no snacks. I should have thought about this. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I should have bought snacks. I have no way to heal myself. This is, this is not good at all. This is really not good because I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly. Yep, there's a minigun. There is a guy with a minigun. Oh, God. Okay, we're managing so far. I'm sorry, sir. You should be dead. Thank you. Are we actually going to do this first time? There's no way. In this shitty van. Uh, to be fair, they just completely f***ed up themselves. That kind of helps a lot. Um, there's a helicopter following me. Maybe I should deal with that. I should definitely deal with that. Oh, God, that does so much damage. Don't fall off, please. Don't fall off, please. Oh, my f***ing God. There we go. And I don't believe any more spawn from this point on. Though I'm extremely surprised at how easy this was compared to last time. I'm pretty sure this mission took me like an hour last time I did it. And so far it's been like 10 minutes or something. 15 maybe max. It is very boring from here on out though. So uh, just cut. And so there we go. What I thought was one of the more difficult missions ended up being pretty simple. I, I don't think I've died yet so far in this mission set. That Again, that won't last, but pretty good. Maybe I am actually getting good at the game. I know I say this every few episodes and then I proceed to not be good the next episode. It's, it's kind of the trend we have on this channel. I act like I have a god complex and an inferiority complex at the same time. It's good fun, trust me. It doesn't give me an internal crisis whatsoever. Now, just before I go ahead and start up with the next mission, I think it's probably a good idea to restock on body armor since I completely ran out and get some snacks because I'm uh, famished. So let's do that quickly. Snacks, 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 snacks. Snacks. Thank you. Goodbye. All right. What do we have this time? Is this the final mission? It actually might be. I don't remember how many there are. Uh, I might actually read the subtitle or subtext or whatever this time, just so I know. Agent, your nexus. Okay, this is not the final mission. I think it might be the second to last one. Now, if I remember correctly, these guys are on top of the construction site. I believe that's. Oh, I know. I remember now. They're on top of the construction site, and then he flies away in a fucking helicopter, and you have to follow him. I remember this now. Oh, whatever. Sh sure, let's do the mission. God damn it. Now, I know he's just at the top, so I'm just going to wait until I get up there. There we go. Hello, Mason. Hello, Mason, you little shit. Why are you, why are you going behind my back again, you little shit? Yeah, you little shit. What are you doing, you little- Okay, I need to stop speaking. Now, we can do this the silent and sneaky way or the loud and proud way. Uh, I'll start silent and sneaky, and if things go wrong like they definitely will, then, uh, loud and proud. Never mind, we're going loud and proud. I f***ed it already. How are you not dead? There was a massive explosion right next to you. What the f- All right, that was easy. Up we go. I, I don't see the drone, like at all. What? Where is the drone? Huh? There it is. Yeah, this combat MG is OP as hell. I love it. So good. All right, uppies again. Let's go. Yeah, I can't lie. The heavy body armor and the combat MG make this mission an absolute breeze. I think last time I did it, I did not have anywhere near as good stuff. So that kind of explains why it was shit. Also, I love that this mission forces me to go up this way when I could just use my oppressor or a helicopter or something and just get to the top and kill everyone. But no, this game doesn't take that into account because it's stupid. How is he not dead? Okay, sniper time. Ow, that guy was a lot closer to me than I thought. Where do they keep coming from? Dude, chill.
Why am I shooting above them? Why are you shooting above them? Get a job. This is my job. You think I'm not doing this because I'm getting paid? The hell? That was close. Okay, I should stop yapping my mouth away and just do my job. That was quick. Yeah, that didn't go to plan. Do I not have a parachute? Wait, do I have to actually go collect a parachute? Are you serious? Why don't I have a parachute already? I always have one. Oh, god damn it, man. This game's so stupid. I was just gonna jump off, but I have to get a parachute because apparently I don't have one because this game's fucking... It doesn't make any sense. I always have a parachute on me. I'm always ready to jump off a building and die. There we go. Now I'll get the parachute. Oh, yeah. God, I'm sorry. Whee! Decent landing, you know? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna, I'm gonna try the tactic. It didn't work. <laughs> Let's try and uh, bounce it off. That may work. It's not. Okay, let's just do this the normal way then. Fucking hell. Well, dude, where is this guy? Wh what are you doing? Okay, you're just useless and stupid. Cool. Mason! Well, that was easy. Oh! Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, you know what? That's gonna be the funniest way to get my first death on this mission. That was stupid. Well, there's the briefcase. And now we go. Drop-off is down at the port. And just like that, another successful mission for the IAA. I, I didn't fail even a little bit. Don't look at the bottom right. It's not important. All right. Now I believe this is the final mission. Don't quote me on that. Yes. Five out of six. You can see there in the uh, tier two challenge update. So just before we get into the final mission, you know what we need to do? Snacks and armor because oh God, I am low. And if you've played this mission before or watched someone else do it, you know, it's a, it's a toughie. So I want to be as prepared as humanly possible. Snacks, please. Thank you. And thank you. Okay, mission number six of Operation Paper Trail. Now, again, if you've seen this mission, you know this is the closest thing to a horror game that is in GTA 5. So uh, I expect to, I expect to get jumps scared at least once. Agent, your final assignment is as follows. You will be granted access to a top secret agency controlled site where you will obliterate all traces of the target software. Do whatever it takes to sanitize the operation. We can't allow any blowback. Unless it's from your mother. <laughs> hey, uh, God, let's get into it. Now, are we gonna be the fortified, the defended, the skilled or the brace or, or the shielded or, or the safeguard safeguard oh i forget how slow you move with this on because it's like proper heavy armor oh god this is gonna be such a long mission now we're going all the way to mount chiliad and we're starting in the city so already it's gonna be like a five minute drive over there or fly because we are using the helicopter um, okay, that just didn't load in for a while. <laughs> I was wondering where the hell we were landing and it just did not load in. I was gonna make like an epic entrance where, like, this is our target, boys. No, but there's just a giant hole in the ground. Good job, Rockstar. You really ruined my video now. But we're here at the silo on the side of Mount Chiliad and it's time to enter the deep, dark depths of, um, an agency facility thingy. Oh, God, I'm dreading this. So, guys, just before we move through, listen. Really listen. You can hear the breathing as well, right? Well, the breathing comes from these guys here and they are AI android robots and they're currently sleeping. However, that won't be for long. And it just makes the entire atmosphere of this mission extremely creepy and uneasy and I'm not really a fan of it, but we have to do it for the content. So uh, let's go. Okay, we're in the control room. Let's get on the power. Should be easy enough, right guys? Should be easy enough, right guys? Yeah, great. We have to find fuses because for some reason, they're not in here already. Yay! Now, I do remember last time it took me absolutely ages to find the fuses because they're hidden in really annoying locations. Well, let's hope that's not the case this time. All right, none in here from what I see. None in here from what it seems, which is a bit surprising. I thought there would be. We have uh, one of the boys with a minigun just chilling, having a good time. I'm sure he won't be a pest to us later. Now, where the hell are these fuses? I I'm pretty sure last time there was one down here. God, it's just so terrifying. He's so loud. Well, I guess there's none down here. Well, at least I don't think there is. Okay, here's our first fuse. And we keep going down the terrifying dark hallways in the quiet, all alone. No one around us. No one to save us. No one to hear our screams. 
Ah! Sorry, I, I didn't mean to jump scare you. Oh, come on. This fuse part is just so... Oh, yep. Jump scare. You fucking asshole. Yeah, so sometimes they glitch out a little bit and have like little uh, uh, movements. I don't, I don't know what to call them. They kind of just like awake for a second and it scares you and it's not very fun. And the only reason I'm doing this is because I'm doing it for you guys. If I was doing this mission by myself, I'd be shitting myself. I can't even lie. But we have two fuses now, which is nice. There is also a hammer here. That's cool, man. I don't, uh, I don't know where the other fuses are. I'm sure they're probably up here somewhere, but I'm not enjoying this process. Just give me the fuses, please. That's all I want. None in here. Great. None here. Fantastic. I hear some breathing. Hello. There are really no fuses in here at all. Where the hell are the other two? Oh my god. Oh, is that one? Yes, let's go. Three. We have three. What are you doing? Thank you. And now the last one, which is probably going to take me ages because I feel like I've searched everywhere, but clearly I haven't. So that means, that means more searching. <laughs> Yay. I swear there's a thing about like, you're supposed to be able to hit these open so you can go in behind or something. Maybe it's this. Yeah, this might be it. It's just, it's just not working. Please. Oh my God. Thank you. Why is it struggling so much? Hit it. Go. Good. Well, there's nothing there. That was a waste of time. Cool. Uh, this isn't looking good for me. I don't know where the last fuse is. This is annoying. I really don't want to search through this whole place again, man. It's so annoying. Why? F*** it. I guess we go back. There's not much else I can do. I've just got to search again until we find it. And now we're back to the power room. Um, where is the final one exactly? Why do they make them so difficult to find, dude? I'm literally going back to the start again. Because I can't find it. This is so stupid. Oh, I hate this mission. Like, the other part's not even difficult. It's just this part that's a pain. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm searching the right places at this point. I'm just so confused. This happened last time as well. I spent like 20 minutes looking for a goddamn fuse. I am a f idiot. Great, now I have no lives, which is, oh, why did I think that was like a box? Oh, I'm, I'm so stupid. I, I, that wasn't for like a funny moment. I'm just an idiot for fuck's sake. Oh my, now I have less lives. Great. So I'm, I'm definitely going to fail later on. Sensational. And I still can't find the goddamn fuse. What a mission, Rockstar. What a fantastic mission you've made here. It's actually good. I'm just complaining because I'm annoyed. Whatever, I'm just going to put the others in. At least I feel some sort of sense of accomplishment from doing this. And I'm just going to find the other one. Woo. See, I just don't know where it would be now. I feel like I've searched everywhere. Like, clearly I haven't, but that's what it feels like. Uh, there's nothing on here. Hello, mate. Nice ass you have there. Very plump and succulent. But just like, where do I go from here? What do I look at? I really thought it would be here, but it's just not. So I also thought it would be here, but it's, it's not. Yeah, I'm kind of stumped. Just a little bit. Just a tiny, teeny, weeny, weeny bit. A little bit stumped. Shut up. Oh. Found it. Well, at least we got that part done with. Now we go into a different room somewhere to uh, basically delete all of their porn. That's essentially what we're doing. And then uh, then we get destroyed by the AI robot boys. If you haven't guessed already, yes, they come alive and try and kill you. And it's not very fun. Although, when I did this last time, I found out that they are very weak to explosives. And uh, fortunately for me, I have a rail gun as well as a grenade launcher, an RPG, and a, a minigun, which will help. So, in saying that, it might not be as difficult as a mission as it used to be. That's fucking terrifying. All right, here we go. We have five, I think five different things we have to burn down with this hacker we have. And then once we get out, we can leave. However, getting out is the difficult part. And considering we have zero lives left, it's all or nothing. Ride or die. Survive or don't. And this is probably where things get a bit fucky. Um, Have the robot boys turned on yet? Maybe not yet. Maybe we do one more. We might do one more. Okay. They will come alive soon though. Don't you worry. And they won't be fun to deal with. Also, I think it's four servers, not five. Sorry, I can't count. I, I didn't pass first grade. And now the fun begins. Help me, please. Yeah, so you can see how ridiculous this is, right? <laughs> Good fucking lord, man. Okay, how many railgun shots does it take? It takes three railgun shots to kill one of them. Very cool. Didn't even hit him. Didn't even hit him. Yeah, I'm nearly dead already. I am nearly dead already. Oh my god, this is terrible. This is absolutely terrible. I I'm gonna die. Oh, I am- How do you survive this? Is this dude gonna die or not? Thank you. They just don't stop shooting, dude. Okay, two shots with a heavy, heavy sniper. That's reasonable. I can, I can do that. 
Okay, well, it's two shots to the head. I don't, I don't know where I'm hitting this guy. I can't really see. There we go. That's good. Let's move on. Let's move. Let's move. Go, 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 go. Now, I think we might be done with all the ones in here, but there are also a lot on our way out of the server room, and they are going to make my life a living hell. Not that it isn't already, you know. If I somehow complete this without having to restart because of my loss of life, uh, I'm going to be <laughs> very surprised, to be honest. And I know I usually try to exaggerate things, but genuinely, I, I really doubt myself in uh, completing this without dying. I don't know how much body armor and how much snacks I have left, I just gotta hope it's enough. All right, here we go. Last server to burn, and then we make our escape. Okay, boys, it's time. Let's fucking go! Sorry, I need to hype myself up because this is a terrifying mission. Oh God, there's more, there's more, there's more. It says escape via the silo exit. That's where we came in. So the GPS is showing me after I get out of this room. Okay, I'm assuming I go this way. Hello, big boy. Uh, I'm gonna give you an RPG. Nice, two shots and he's down. Not too unreasonable. Yeah, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Dude, they shred. They absolutely shred you. Holy f- It is no joke. I just lost all my body armor and health within like seconds. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, that worked. No, I'll take it. Oh, no. All right, that does not seem to be working. That does. Okay, maybe not as well as I thought. What if I use their own weapon against them? Pretty good as well. How do you like the taste of your own medicine, bitch? Yeah, take that. Oh, I don't have many heals left, but we move. Okay, the minigun is working wonders. You love to see it. Oh my f God, are you kidding me? An explosion got me, really? Oh, God damn it, man. I was doing so well. Why did that have to be my fate? Are you kidding? <laughs> God damn it. Nothing ever goes to plan on this channel, does it? Nothing. Great. How far are you going to put me back? Please don't put me back that far. I did well. Are oh, you fucking kidding me? What is this bullshit? Oh my god, they're up here. Yeah, it's, it's over. It's over. Because they don't get body armor and health back. They're all here. Every single one of them is back in this room. How the f*** am I supposed to do this now? Oh, Christ. Dude, they're literally all in here. Every single one of them is in here. What do I do? I love how he's just standing there and taking it. It's kind of funny. You know what? Minigun time. You deserve it. Oh. Well, that was easy. Okay, how many more of you are there? Because I'll take on every single one of you if I have to, which I, I do. This is not working. We're almost back to where we were before. Let's not get exploded this time, please. I'd really appreciate it. Okay, I think we're good for this area. On to the next. Strategic, I would say. No match for my minigun, though. My gold minigun. My baby. My precious. You guys suck, lol. Come on, show yourself. I know you want to. Expose yourself to me, big boy. Are you gonna expose yourself? Good man. Now, I believe there's just one more in the first room we came into. And then we're good? Okay, that scared me. A little bit. Now, is that all? Or is there going to be one final boy? If there is a final boy, tell me now or, or you will be dead. Final boy? Final boy? No, I think we're okay. I think we're all right. Are we done? Did we do it? Oh my god, we did it! We would have actually done it first time as well without dying, but the fucking explosion got me. It's so annoying, dude. <laughs> so stupid. Uh, it is what it is, though. Oh, look at that. The beautiful sunset, the pink blue skies, and uh, someone's coming to kill us. Great, what a surprise. <laughs> Fuck you. Well, time to escape. Boys, it's been fun. See you in the next life. What if I just died there? That'd have been funny. Another successful day for the IAA. And for me, Lankman Dan, your favorite YouTuber on the platform. This is some dangerous stuff here, boys. Get to the car. Come on. Guy's really bad at shooting. Good <laughs> Jesus. Ow! Shit, okay. And you know what? Just for your, just for your niceties.
Did he just crash on his own accord? Okay, I was gonna give him the pleasure of being killed by yours truly, but apparently he didn't need my help. Oh wait, where am I going? Shit. I thought the IAA facility was the one in the city. I'm being stupid. I literally just drove past it. Well, boys, it's been a fun ride. I hope you enjoyed the episode. There is the ULP or Operation Paper Trail missions completed on Broke to Ballin. How lovely. Again, with the awkward pauses, man. Just complete thank you. It's not that difficult, is it? Out of all the missions in Operation Paper Trail, that one paid the least. Great. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> uh, but we should be getting a big bonus cash from completing this for the first time. I imagine it's going to be 100,000, probably. It might be more, maybe 200 if we're lucky. Uh, I guess we'll see. We'll have to wait a little bit because, again, this game is slow as hell. How much are we going to get, Rockstar? How much do you want to give me? You're really going to make me wait, huh? No, that's fine. I can wait. I've been, I've been waiting all life for this moment, baby. I would appreciate it if you were a bit quicker though. Come on, man. Bonus payment, you know, for, the, for first time completion, for the hard work, for my lovely, courageous... You, is this seriously no bonus ca cash? The, no way there's not any bonus cash for completing that for the first time. I I, I refuse to believe it. Uh, I will go ahead and claim these things, even though I, I literally couldn't give less of a shit, but I will claim them. And any, any bonus? God, this game is ass.